Well, that wind kicking up the waters off the Gulf Coast today. This was a scene following last night's storms. Mm, Fox 10's Lee Pack is down in Gulf Shores where the waves and winds aren't expected to let up until this weekend. Well, that's right, Byron and Shelby. They're expecting life threatening rip currents through Friday night. And even though we didn't see anyone in the chilly waters today, they're still putting out a warning. Mother Nature definitely showing off today. I surf upwards of eight to nine feet down in Gulf Shores. This is beautiful. It's wonderful. I love it down here. I love it. I love it. While the red flags and patrolling lifeguards are keeping people out of the water, wind gusts up to 50 miles per hour, keeping things fun on the beach. The wind is very strong and it just kind of like pushes me like it is right now. And it's just, I can just do this. Not a normal day. No, it's very windy. Visiting from northern Illinois, this couple in awe of the Gulf Coast. We live about an hour and a half from the windy city of Chicago, but it's not like this. <laughs> Married for three years, their goal to kiss in every state. With only three to go, they've managed to knock off quite a few this trip, including Alabama. Oh my goodness, Ohio, Pennsylvania, West Virginia, Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Maryland, yeah, I think that's it. Florida, and Alabama. For Aiden McAllister, it was a chance to fly his kite. After several attempts, third time's the charm. Looks like you got the hang of it now. Yeah, um, it's just hard to get used to. Yeah. And with storm season coming to a close, locals here are thankful it wasn't as active as last year. Oh, it's been a lot better, um, you know, where everybody's just recovering from Sally. So, you know, everybody's in working condition and can have the rest of the year without having to repair a bunch of, uh, a lot of your houses. Definitely spared compared to last year. This storm season officially ends November 30th. In Gulf Shores tonight, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News.